Namaste. 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 And they said no. She would like to have a good toilet. The family have asked me, will there be a privacy and safety? They also asked about toilet uses lot of water because they have to carry from hill on their back and bring for drinking water. Biogas uh, would be uh, preferable for her so that she can have less smoke in her kitchen. At the moment, they are using firewood in the kitchen, and when they cook, the house is full with the smoke. <coughs> and that is affecting their children and their families on their respiratory system. Then I explain about our toilet system. Our toilet has got a privacy and safety measurements built together very strongly. We place the water tank. That helps in storing the water, which helps them hand washing and cleaning the toilet. We, then we also explain about uh, reducing smoke in the kitchen by using human waste uh, and mix with the cow dung together into the digester. That will produce a gas in the, in the kitchen for them to use uh, uh, for cooking and that will reduce their uh, respiratory infection problems and cough and eye problems with the, with the smoke. <laughs> The family decided to have a toilet and now he is going to meet with the village uh, sanitation committee chairman to, to discuss about the process on how he can get the toilet soon. The chairman explained he needs to do the application first. The engineer will go to his place and do the site selection measurements and locate for the construction site. We'll have a family agreement with the village committee and the NGO in Nepal and the cash contribution. The family will have to excavate on the location. They also need to assist them in, in work. As well as provide them food. I showed him the completed toilet, the door, which have given much privacy and safety. The tap inside the toilet that help in deep flossing and cleaning of the toilet. The deep floss toilet removing all the waste from the toilet pan. We put the toilet brush with the rope and secure inside the toilet. Then I showed a clothes hook is placed to use for the long clothes or the towels to, to hang while people use the toilet. Outside the toilet, here is the tap for hand washing after uh, someone used the toilet. The water we are collecting from roof also, so that, that helps reducing carrying the water. We place the gutter and, and the tank behind the toilet, where the rainwater also collect, collected and they also fill the water. Now, this is biogas. <laughs> this is the mixing where we mix the cow dung to build the gas inside the digester in the dome and that gas is taken into the kitchen which has reduced smoke in the kitchen. Once the family gets the toilet, we 
provide hand washing technique class for the, the whole family together. And we focus for the mothers so that they can teach the children and build the hand washing habit from the childhood. This is biogas cooking. The family is getting three to four hours of clean, smokeless gas. The lady is making masala tea. And she is cooking with that one, which is reducing the smoke in the house and thus the benefit on health. These children will have less smoke and healthier life. <laughs> he asked how is the program supported. I explained that sanitation program has got international support, the local based NGO and the village committee all work together to make this thing happen. The international partner help us in designing of the structure. The, the local based NGO is managing all financing and the pro work in the field. And finally, the evaluation takes place. Uh, international partner, the NGO and the village committee all together we go and check the quality of the product. Each family in the program is directly linked to those who help them. I feel much more happier and satisfied in my soul for helping those people.